Imagine your favorite NFL team drafting the fiercest competitor ever. Warner Brothers Tasmanian Devil. He's about to score for your team with these exciting new Taz in the NFL watches. There's one for each and every team, both NFC and AFC. 28 exciting designs in all. Each watch features an accurate quartz movement, water resistance to 100 feet, an action Taz NFL team logo, and a unique football second hand. Taz fever is sweeping the country. Don't let this devil catch you without your NFL team watch score big with this special tv offer only 39.95 it's a devil of a deal so pick your favorite nfl team and order now call toll free 1-800-421-2000 or send 39.95 plus 3.95 shipping and handling to taz nfl watches p.o box 8449 atlanta georgia Hello, and welcome back to another great episode of the amazing Atari Aficionado. So, for today's episode, I'm talking about Taz. No, 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 no. Not that Taz. The Tasmanian Devil, of course. That's why I'm wearing the shirt. So Taz came out in 1983 for the Atari 2600. Um, he's obviously one of the earlier uh, Looney Tunes characters to get his own game. So that is actually really cool because looking back to the earlier Taz cartoons, he obviously uh, was not as popular as, say, Bugs Bunny or Daffy Duck or maybe Tweety uh, and, and characters like that. Uh, but through the years, he did get very, very popular. Uh, speaking of which, he even got his own TV show. Welcome to Atlantis Way, under, down, under. The sky's always yellow in rain or shine. Come in Tasmania, come to Tasmania. Mom's alive, why are dads never gone along? Molly's all fired up, will take place with the dog. Come in Tasmania, come to Tasmania. Didgery Dingo and Wendell T. Wolf. Francis X. Bush lad is never on cool. Bushwhacker Bob and his mother gold mom. Constance and Dick Lee just want to have fun. Forgetter and Axel are always left sore. If you have a deal, just call Buddy Ball. The pineapple sprout. Oh, yeah, don't forget Taz. He put the Taz in Tasmania, down in Tasmania, come to Tasmania. We need you! <laughs> it's a pretty simple game, which I'm actually going to show you some game footage of. Um, but just looking at the cover of the game, it does actually explain the gameplay very well. You were Taz, and you do actually spin through the game, and you are collecting things like hamburgers, root beer, ice cream cones, and other various food, and you are trying to avoid the dynamites. Uh, just like in true Looney Tunes fashion, there are ways that you can explode uh, in this game. And you are trying to avoid the dynamite, of course, while eating everything else on screen. Uh, it's definitely one of my, uh, I would put this in the top 10 category of best all-time Atari game. Ugh. It's definitely a fun one. And uh, if you haven't played it, if you haven't seen it, if you haven't found it, I totally recommend that you hunt down and get yourself a copy of Taz or download it or whatever kids are doing nowadays in 2020. But if you're lucky enough like me to have the original cartridge... This is definitely a great piece to have in my collection. Now let's take a look at some game footage. Uh, all right, ladies and gentlemen, now here it is. So obviously you want to avoid that dynamite. And there I am getting some hamburgers. Let's turn this down a little bit so it's not blaring in everybody's ears. Hopefully you can still hear it. Oh, I just died. Alright, looks like the sound is going to be loud no matter what. So if you need to turn down your speakers, just turn them down. 
But yeah, this is fun, you know? I, I, I'm not gonna play this forever. I'm just basically gonna show you guys a couple. Not, there, there's obviously different levels as you collect the food. I just don't remember offhand how long each level is. I'm kind of playing it safe. But that's not a bad way. You know, but it's there's definitely other levels that get faster. And like I said, the variety of food uh, will change uh, as the levels progress. So, there you have it. You're the little tornado in the center of the screen moving around, just avoiding obstacles and collecting fast food. You know, you can't get more Atari than this. Oh! So anyway, ladies and gentlemen, oh, there we go. We've seen how we got the root beer. How perfect. So this is the amazing Atari aficionado coming at you live. Well, not live, but coming at you with some live game footage, that is. <laughs> so... Well, live when I recorded it. Thanks so much for watching. Take care. Deep in the jungles of Tasmania, two brave adventurers pursue the elusive beast. There he is. Let's get him. Come back here, Taz. I got him, Brad. Hey, what are you kids up to? Playing with Tornado Taz, Mom. Tornado Taz, he spins, he whirls, he speaks. Taz. He's cuddly, too. <laughs> Taz love Taz. Tornado Taz, new from Play by Play. Get yours before they all disappear. <laughs> Hello once again, the amazing Atari aficionado here. If you've made it this far into the video, then I congratulate you. Because I have a special announcement and a special giveaway happening. Starting with this video. This video and the next two amazing Atari videos that I release... What I'm going to be doing is giving away, and let's go over the prizes real quickly here, an Atari catalog, that's right, I'm going to be giving away a combat, 1977 combat manual, it is official and full, none of the pages are missing from any of those, I'm going to be giving away two Sears Telegames manuals, one is Arcade Pinball and one is Circus, and I'm also going to be giving away a haunted house uh, video game and this is a uh, the yellow uh, version uh, there is also an orange one that is floating around so for the crazy variant collectors out there like me um, this is the yellow fonted uh, haunted house I'll be giving all of that away to the person who comments the most so starting like I said with this video and the next two videos the person who comments the most will be the winner. Now, if there's a situation where somebody comments on all three videos, and let's say we have two sets of people, then names will be thrown into a hat and the drawing will be live, so there'll be no chicanery. So like I said, if you want to win some Atari stuff, comment this video and the next two videos. There you go. Nice and simple. Start commenting. Thanks for watching.